I became a Christian about six years ago, um, it was very, very difficult for me to study the Word. I didn't realize the importance of knowing the Word. I knew it was important, but it was very hard for me to, to chew and to digest. It wasn't until about maybe two years ago that I really had a yearning to know the Word of God better. I was really ignorant in respect to the Bible. I've always believed in, in the Lord. However, I didn't know anything about His Word. If you were to ask me anything about the Bible, I was very ignorant. It's like a big book. You know, it was a big book. I didn't become a believer until my late teens. And at that time, I pretty much understood what salvation was. And I, all I was told was just read your Bible and pray. Well, it was very difficult to understand that because I did not know what the Bible was. They would say it was the Word of God, but it had no meaning to me. But I never hooked up with what the Bible was all about. And I kind of put God on the back burner for about 50 years. We are a predominantly uh, Asian American uh, congregation uh, with probably about 20 to 25 percent uh, Latino and that's pretty close to what the demographic of our city is. We have always believed in the priesthood of all believers um, that when, whenever we come to church we all come with a, a hymn or a uh, a word uh, for each other, some kind of encouragement. And so the, the underlying uh, principle behind our ministry is, is empowering ordinary people to do the work of Jesus, uh, to do great things. And so we believe that people come with, with something valuable to share. And, and our job is to help them express that, uh, maybe believe in them more than they believe in themselves, and just being able to see people through the, the lens of the gospel. Trinity Church uh, in Monterey Park, we have uh, this one Sunday school class with women. I've always had a love for scripture and, and I've always wanted to share that love with the other women and, and they were always a little resistant. They were always like, they didn't feel like that they had um, just even the ability to, to take the Bible and just read it and and to be able to interpret it on their own and um, and they were really nervous about it and and so the ladies they said okay let's try this we went for it and and it was really really exciting right from the get-go people were just so open to um, allowing the Holy Spirit to just um, lead them to through Scripture every Sunday morning we have a group of about anywhere between 8 to 12 women who gather in a room and what's fascinating about this study is that they don't bring any study aids. Very few simple tools like being able to look up the, the Greek and the Hebrew original meaning of the word, uh, things like that. But, but what it really is is just trusting God to speak to us directly through his word without an interpreter, without somebody else, without a, a scholar in between you and the text. It's just you and the text. I think through this study of just um, digging a little bit deeper into the word and finding just its original Greek meaning, it's given me confidence that I can look up these things and I have something to offer something when I go every Sunday, that we're all bringing things from our experiences, from how we've spent time with the Lord and how we've dug into the word. And it's given me a sense of confidence that I do have something to offer now. And the word has just really come alive for me in a way that I really want to know um, God's word more. And I, I am, I feel like it's, like, I love the Bible now. I feel really uh, mentored when I'm sitting there with these great ladies because, like I said, I've had nothing, no background, you know, with the Bible and so forth. So I've been with the church for going to be going on five years, and I still feel like I'm a newcomer. However, I can say that my growth in learning His Word is, is like, tremendous. Christine brought this concept which really just made the Bible so real to me. She made it so personal. She made it um, for the diverse women in the group to understand that the Bible is indeed a personal love story for us individually. It isn't so much what, is, what happens in that classroom, it's what happens outside of that classroom. That at home, uh, women are opening up the Word and it's coming alive to them and they're realizing that, that the Bible is interesting and relevant to their lives. We have uh, a couple of women who have been in the uh, Christians for a long time, grown up in the church, 
And they have said, I've never been able to en enjoy reading the Bible or understand it, but now for the first time in my life, I feel like someone has given me the keys. The women sharing this experience together have connected in such a strong way that as we're studying the Bible, we're also opening up different areas of our lives and, and how the Lord has been speaking to us specifically through the verses in the Bible. And the friendships that's made in, those, in, in that class is just amazing. The women have really stepped up to um, just encouraging each other and spurring each other on to just to have a more complete fullness knowledge of, of who Jesus is and who we are in light of who, who He is. Thank you.